Hello everybody! Making our first treasure hunting video. This one we're filming right in our backyard. We do a lot of treasure hunting and metal detecting on our own property. Okay, as you guys can see, we've moved a lot of dirt. Some of this is from landscaping in the front yard. We check all the dirt with our metal detectors that we bring back here though. And the rest of it we dug out of our hole. The house was built sometime in the 1920s and we discovered a trash pile in the backyard uh, where they buried a lot of early 1900s trash and now we think it's treasure. This is our treasure shelf. These are a lot of the cool little things that we pulled out of the ground in the backyard. A lot of glass bottles. That's why I stopped metal detecting it after a while and I just get out there with the hand shovel and make sure not to break these. This was the very first one we found, this pretty dark blue glass. This is a really cool one. The glass topper was still in it, in the dirt. Found this old insulator, a really t pretty turquoise color, in pretty good condition. A little chip off of it right here. Yeah, a lot of cool bottles and little trinkets we found. Found this really neat toy tow truck. According to the internet, it dates back to the 1930s. All of this was right here in our backyard. All right, gonna showcase a few more of our cool finds. Uh, so this is a musket ball, it's pretty heavy, nice and round. Oops. We got some cool buttons, really neat designs, and this old military button. That one is really nice. This was another one of our cool finds in the backyard. It's called a wizard clip. It has a cool little design on it. I'm going to try to make it where you guys can see the word. Wizard is written right there. This used to be uh, held, I guess, in your, oops, in your sleeve when you're playing poker and you can kind of like keep a card up your sleeve for cheating. When we read up on it, that's what they said this was used for, so we thought that was really cool. Okay, I already showed you a lot of the little things we find, um, but there's also quite a few big things we pulled out of the dirt. That's why the hole is so big. Um, here's a few of them. We have this cool little iron. Um, this big thing right here, we think is like an old windshield of a really old car. We have a lot of little horseshoes that we pulled out, three or four of these. We are not even sure what these are. Some really cool broken glass plates with pretty designs. I'm sort of, sort of bummed we haven't found a full plate yet, but haven't lost hope yet. But yeah, lots of big metal pieces that we pull out of the ground. And we just keep working on it. It's a little hard to tell the hole right now. I'm gonna clean it up. I'm gonna weed eat and get some of the grass out of it. But here it is. Some of the dirt caved in, so I'm gonna get that cleaned out as well. And then we'll get back to treasure hunting in it. Uh, a lot of this caved in when it rained. 
Uh, so the hole was much deeper right here, so I'm going to wheelbarrow it out now. Okay, so I'm just kind of showing you guys the level we're trying to get down to. It's this crack. This is where we were digging before. This is kind of the line of the trash pile. Um, we want to get down that deep throughout the whole hole again. So we've been digging out this back corner a little bit. This is just some of the stuff we've already pulled out. Um, it probably just came out when the dirt fell in the rain. So just pieces of iron. Here's some of the glass. These ones are broken. Nails in there. Here's a bottle cap. So this is the type of stuff we keep an eye out for. This is the corner I've been digging in. You can kind of see some of the stuff in here. I just try to pick out as much as I can because we usually go back through with a metal detector. So as much metal as I can pull out first, then we won't pick it up on the metal detector. So maybe we can find the good stuff. Okay, this is where I've been digging. This is um, the level we want to get down to um, where the dirt is all much darker. This is where a lot of the trash has been. We, we think they uh, maybe burnt the trash pile or something. That's why the dirt is so dark down here. But it's pretty stuck. So I'm just softening some of it up and digging it out. There's some big rocks in there. Oh, something fell out. We got some glass right here. We got this chunk of iron. Oh look, it could be a horseshoe maybe, a little one. That's pretty cool. I don't know what that is. See, this is where I want to be more careful because there, I just found a ton of nails or wire or something up against this wall. Yeah, there's something in there. And this is where I start to use the hand shovel because I definitely don't want to break any bottles that I find. Something in there. Let's see, here's some more of that pretty glass. I wish I would find one full plate or something. Okay, there's a big chunk of something right here. That's a rock. It's a long process digging all this out. But it's worth it. Ooh. Just pulled these out. There's two chunks of iron. Got little features on them, like right there. Whatever that is. Pretty cool. Big chunks of iron. Make sure I didn't knock out anything. Cool. Uh, see? That's why we think it's burnt. You find big old pieces of like coal. We think the whole layer was burnt. Here's a little thing. <laughs> I don't know what it is. A lot more iron. Another piece of glass. 
We're getting into the good stuff. This metal thing looks cool right here. Could just be a can or something. It's all starting to fall out. Okay, I think I'm done digging for the day. Um, this isn't too bad for only digging for about an hour. We found all this. Most of it is trash we'll just throw it away uh, we'll probably keep maybe this horseshoe thing um, but yeah other than that I'm gonna metal detect the dirt that we pulled out of the hole a little bit to make sure we didn't miss any coins or anything valuable and then I'll probably get back to digging tomorrow I got a lot of work to do okay I'm gonna metal detect the dirt now make sure we didn't throw any coins in it or anything out of our hole since it's my first treasure hunting video, I should tell you about my metal detector. It's the Fisher F11. It's pretty lightweight, nothing too fancy, but I find treasure with it just the same. So I'm gonna start metal detecting. Okay, I'm gonna check this. Not the best signal, but let's see what it is. now you find a lot of those metal detecting probably got another chunk of iron here haven't found much and then dig this up really quick oh it's right on the surface probably oh that's it <laughs> looks round that's probably why it sounded okay just a big nail keep checking right here Little piece of wire. Pretty much all I found, some nails, oops, and some iron, so I think I'm going to call it a day. Jeez, keep dropping it. There it is. I'm done metal detecting for the day, and I'll just keep working on the hole starting tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching my video. If you enjoyed it, please like and subscribe, and it'll definitely motivate me to get back out there and keep hunting.